So this video is going to show you how to create a meme. So when you open up a Google Slides, first get rid of the themes. I hate the boxes. Get rid of those. First, you need to change the page setup. File, page setup. You can go down to custom. Now memes are square, so I'm going to keep it as inches and do six by six inches. Apply. Now I have a square. Next, you need an image. We're going to go to the image, search the web, I'm going to search for coffee. Find an image that you like. I think I'll keep it basic. Insert. Now I've got a lot of empty space here, so you can resize it. I recommend you drag from the corners to cover the space. Otherwise, you will have a distorted image. You double click on the image. You have this black line. Then you can crop it. Just make sure that and hit enter. And now I've got my picture of my coffee. Now, meme also needs text. So instead of using a text box, the way you're going to obtain that meme effect is by using word art. Under the insert menu, you can choose word art. I'm going to coffee. Now this isn't a particularly good meme, but now we've got it here. To obtain that meme-like text, you're going to use a font called Impact. So you need to find that. If you don't have that listed, you can always click this More Fonts and then find it. And you can always choose a different font. Now because it's word art, you can just drag, stretch, and do, that looks horrible, whatever you would like here. Now the white, I can change. So maybe I want it red. That looks terrible. Go with an orange. That looks terrible. But this is the point, is you can find what works for you, and now you have a meme. Now if you want to share this and download it to post somewhere or use in a different app, you can go to File, Download, and then I recommend downloading as a PNG. Now I will link to another video that I have on creating a meme that doesn't have any audio, just shows that you may want to share with students. One of the great things about this is if you choose to have students create a meme for an assignment, you can assign a single Google slide deck through Google Classroom and have different students be working on their meme within a single slide deck. And then you, as a teacher, particularly in distance learning, if you want to see what they're doing, as they're doing it, you can go to View Grid View and you will have a view of all your student slides and you can see how they might need help or need assistance. Hope this was helpful. If you enjoyed this, please like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time.